all want to be part of the video. <laughs> <laughs> all right, so we want to shoot a video just going through what you guys are all working on okay. and talking through it as a team. That's right awesome. Now? Yeah, we're going to do it right now. Okay. <laughs> Right now we are trying to figure out the outlines of uh, passenger ergonomics. We we'll put in five percent of human first, uh, human body, five percent, ninety percent, ninety-five, and ninety-nine. And then from there we are deriving those outlines. You can see like those lines. And then we are developing a cap around it. So these are establishing all the hard points for the vehicle. We also need to do a benchmark to see who our competitors are and what kind of uh, clearances and hard points they have. So all this is very important in the uh, design phase so that uh, we can either target best in class or do we want to meet the same uh, numbers as what our benchmark vehicles are. We are looking at 1% female, 50% male, 95th percentile male positioned as for the SAE requirements. Uh, this is with the uh, this is for the front seats. We are still working on the rear seats, and we are looking at the seats with the steering wheel position clearances for that clearances for crash conditions and all that. Uh, still work in progress, but it's good progress that we've been making for the past two weeks. So we basically take this package model, and as this develops, we can really define where all the different components go in the vehicle and how the actual occupant needs to interact. From there, that will go into our actual like overall vehicle architecture of how the frame needs to sit, um, where the driver sits, um, and where the body actually goes. And like Azreen was saying, it sets all the hard points up. 